Hey YouTube, what is happening? Balrock here. Just imagine the power of the chameleon with the utility and custom mechanics of the negotiator's dilemma. What is going to happen is you kill one enemy and then you kill them all. So you don't want to miss this build. Uh, let's get it. Cool, you made it. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. So to get the max value out of this build uh, up to uh, 278 percent critical hit damage, full critical hit chance, and 115 percent weapon damage, and ultimately getting those multiple kills, there are two things you need to know. First, the Chameleon, uh, a great exotic assault rifle with a particular talent and mechanics that you need to master, and second, how the Negotiator's Dilemma gear set works. I'll cover those two things so you can learn how to make the most out of this build or any new build you create around it. The Chameleon, if you don't know, uh, it's a high pace assault rifle that it excels at close range and not so much at long range. It has a nice optic mod uh, with 15% critical hit chance, 10% stability, 20% accuracy and plus 20 rounds rolled with health damage and critical hit chance again. So we get a lot of critical hit chance right off the bat. There are three buffs that you need to activate in order to get the most out of this weapon. Hitting 30 headshots and you get 20% critical hit chance and 50% critical hit damage for 45 seconds. Hitting 75 body shots, you get 90% weapon damage for 45 seconds. Hitting 30 leg shot, you get 150 reload speed for 45 seconds. And all the buffs cool down pause when you're out of combat. So now the Negotiator's Dilemma gear set focuses on high critical hit chance and critical hit damage. 15% critical hit chance on two pieces and 20% critical hit damage on three pieces. Now with four pieces, we get the Hostile Negotiations buff or mark that you will see on an enemy when you tag or mark it. The way you can tag an enemy in PvP or PvE is doing a critical hit to the enemy and will last for 20 seconds. And you can mark up to three different targets at the same time. So when you critical hit one of the marked enemies, all other marked enemies take 60% of that damage. And if a marked enemy dies, you gain plus 2% critical hit damage up to 20 times until combat ends. So that adds up to 40% uh, critical hit damage. So guys, before I show you how it works, uh, I appreciate you being here. Uh, slap the like button to get this video to more people. And a large percentage of people watching my videos are not subscribed. So please consider subscribing if you like this video. So this is how the targeting works. Uh, you critical hit one enemy, it gets marked, and you see the red icon next to, to the enemy's name. Then you can target a second one and a third one too. Now, if you critical hit one of the mark enemies, the other marked ones take damage. And if you kill them, you get that plus 2% critical hit damage. And it's just rinse and repeat. Uh, make sure you have your marks up at all times and critical hit one of them to damage the other ones and kill them all. Uh, this works for PvP and PvE as well. When you see the build, you will know uh, how you can get that high value up to uh, 278 critical hit damage and plus 115% uh, weapon damage. The spec that I have is the gunner and really it can be whatever spec you guys want. I choose gunner because it's better when soloing content and wanted to use the banshee pulse uh, for a reason that I will explain in just a moment. Uh, the main weapon again is the chameleon uh, that has a high RPM and a lot of critical hit chance right off the bat. So you won't have any problem getting uh, those critical hits to proc the Negotiator's Dilemma's damage. Uh, it does decent damage, but when you proc the headshot and body shot buffs of the Chameleon, you will see the difference and adding Negotiator's Dilemma damage buff, uh, you will make a lot of damage to single target and the marked target. Uh, just remember that a long range is not so good, so you might have to stay at mid-range or close range. A secondary weapon, you can use whatever you want and you feel comfortable with. The mask is our first Negotiator's Dilemma piece, rolled with critical hit damage and a critical hit damage gear mod. To achieve the high critical hit damage of this build, we need every gear mod to be critical hit damage. The holster is our second piece, uh, rolled with critical hit damage. The gloves is our third piece, with critical hit damage rolled as well. 
The backpack is our four piece rolled, uh, you guessed it, with critical hit damage that will give us a uh, hostile negotiations talent. And having the backpack increases that talent damage from 60 to 100%. So all critical hit damage you make to a marked enemy, the exact damage is done to the other two marked enemies. The knee pads are the fox sprayer roll with critical hit damage and damage to target out of cover, that it's a must. And the chest is a group of sombra to increase uh, by 15% the critical hit damage. I got a roll with critical hit damage and headshot damage. Since we don't need critical hit chance because we are going to put it over the cap uh, with the chameleon and the two pieces of negotiator dilemma. Pair with the obliterate talent that will get up to plus 25% weapon damage when doing crit. And that's what we need to do with this build to proc the negotiator dilemma damage is critical hits. The enemies. That way we get more damage. We kill and then we get even more damage. The skills uh, to use in this build are pretty much up for grabs. Uh, you can use whatever you feel comfortable with and will make you move well in battle. Uh, I'm using a striker drone to help with aggro and get uh, those hiding the enemy out of cover in PvE. And the Banshee Pulse to disorient group of enemies to apply the marks easily. The final stats of this build is a 91k weapon damage with a plus 115 weapon damage coming from the chameleon body shot buffs and obliterate chase talent 49 percent critical hit chance that with the chameleon headshot uh, buff will put it over the cap of 60 percent and and 188 critical hit damage that will get quickly up to 278 percent with the chameleon headshot buff and killing marked enemies with the negotiator dilemma what I recommend with this build in PvE is to mark the first two enemies and then the third one, make it the stronger one of the three, if possible. For example, you can mark uh, two reds and then the third one could be an elite or a purple. That way, when hitting it, it will surely kill the other two. What you want is to keep the marks uh, up the most of the time. Kill the enemies to get that critical hit damage bonus per kill. So the chameleon is a great weapon to achieve this. So that's it for the build guys. I hope it was helpful to you and you can understand at least a little bit more about the power and mechanic of the negotiator dilemma. So slap that like button uh, so more people can see this build. Uh, thank you for watching and if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Uh, I really appreciate it and can't wait to send more videos your way. As always guys, take care, be safe and ball rock out. Ciao.